Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to do a Q&A. I don't have that many questions, but if I know myself right, I will ramble on until I don't have any battery or space on my memory card. So, I did a post on my YouTube channel, or the feed community tab, is it called that? And I asked if you had any questions for me, baby girl related or not, because I have gotten a lot of new followers since I did something like this. All of the questions are about baby girl, so let me just talk about her for a minute. Um, so if you don't want to hear about my baby, this is not the video for you. <laughs> As of today, when I'm filming this on Tuesday, <laughs> she was born on Tuesday, she is 11 weeks old. Right now she is sleeping uh, and it is two and a half hours since I put her to sleep. She is very good at napping. Just saying. But yes, she is 11 weeks old now, which is insane that in a few weeks she will, oh, one and a half week, she will be three months old. It is insane that I've been a mom for almost three months and he has been a big brother and he is so good with her. That is also a question I will get to. But yes, she has always been easy and we didn't want to jinx it at first, but she is easy and she was the dream baby or oh, she is the dream baby because she's easy she doesn't cry she's not unhappy we can calm her down if she is crying we are going to weigh her without her clothes on she hate that so that's when she gets unhappy and we can calm her down um so that's that's fine <laughs> and she doesn't really cry when she's hungry unless it has been quite a while and i'm l uh, very slow at feeding her because i do breastfeed then she will be crying but it is crying because she's actually just saying that she is hungry um and if she gets tired she also gets a little fussy but it is only the fussy part she doesn't really get to the point where she is crying crying which is really really nice and she has always been a good sleeper we have or maybe like the first week when she should she was adapting to the world we didn't get much sleep but she has always been okay good at sleeping like two or three hours in a row and she still is in the night time sometimes she even sleeps through the night now and that has happened twice <laughs> and we didn't sleep through the night i have slept like four hours because then she says some noises in her dreams and then i wake up and give her the pacifier but yes she is a dream baby and she is so sweet and beautiful and i love her so much that you could cry about it and that is just a mom thing. She does. Her nap time is like from 10 to 2 or 3 in the afternoon. So that is like 4 or 5 hours I can get every single day for myself when I could do my makeup or something like that. Right now she wakes up about 5.30 in the morning and I can give him some food uh, once or twice and then she can just put go back to sleep. <laughs> and today she slept until 11 so nap time was about 12 and now it is almost three o'clock in the afternoon so she sleeps a lot <laughs> she does and that is really really nice let's just get down to the questions okay the first question is what is her name <laughs> that was the first question and the first comment on this post i immediately did my own comment and wrote i'm not going to say her name <laughs> Because that is a secret and we have decided to keep that a secret, the only secret in this pregnancy and about her and to the world and our families. It is a tradition in my family, my mother's family, to keep the name of the baby a secret until the baptism. And her baptism is in the end of January, so you need to be patient. We're not patient, but we try to be. <laughs> and it's really, really hard not to tell her name to family or write it or something like that because we love the name we call her her name just me and john so it's really really hard when uh, our parents or something like that is here and they are trying to guess her name her name is a secret and you guys will know her name because there will be some kind of video or something like that from her baptism i think so or at least some pictures on my instagram where i will announce it so if you don't follow me on instagram you should definitely do so 
It is just my name, Elizabeth B. Christensen. Oh yeah, that was also a question. I'm curious to know the reason behind keeping her name secret. If that's not too personal to ask, she's beautiful. Thank you. It's not personal. It's just a tradition in our family. The only that, that is the only reason we don't say it is because we want to keep the tradition alive and have one secret about her because we told everybody that we were expecting a girl and we told everybody um, when she came and we published her on the social media which I know not everyone likes to do and I have full respect for that but we are just too excited to not share her with the world when she gets older she gets to decide if he, she wants to be posted or not but for right now we just love her too much to not to share with our friends. So that is the reason. So there is a question. Has having a baby changed the way you will things, view things in the world? Right now for the COVID-19, uh, yes. We don't see people we don't normally see. We only see family and the closest, closest friends. We don't hug as much, which I miss so much. I love hugging. It is... A thing I don't like the elbow thing but I don't mind not going to the bigger parties and meeting new people and stuff like that that is not me anyway so I like being home with her um, and just seeing our family for that matter it has changed the world because I want to keep her safe and uh, we're minimizing the contact with other people because we don't want to get COVID-19. In general, seeing the world in another perspective uh, would be if I watch a movie or something like that and something happens uh, that could be your kid, your own kid related stuff, I begin crying. <laughs> so stupid. I just feel a little bit more about stuff and Maybe I'm just a little bit more chill and protective of her uh, and that is pretty normal to, when you're being mom. I don't have an exact example but the feeling when not being a parent when oh relax it's not that important or you can just be spontaneous and stuff like that. Well, <laughs> those opinions have changed a little bit. We are still trying to be somewhat spontaneous because we know her pattern. And it's just a little bit more coordination. But, yeah. <laughs> it has changed. It has, but I don't have a concrete example for you. That was a bad answer. I'm sorry. I don't know what else to say. Oh, she's so cute. What a little, do little doll. Thank you. <laughs> Uh, thank you so much. You're so sweet, guys. You're so sweet. She's a sweetie beauty like her mama. Congrats to you both. Oh, thank you. She's she's beautiful. Do you guys think she's beautiful? <laughs> uh, congratulations. Thank you. And a little bundle of joy. Okay, then I think it is the last question because I think she is almost waking up and... I hope you guys got satisfied a little bit about my answers. Otherwise, you should, you can always do more questions in the comments, and I will answer you and get back to you. The last one is about him. <laughs> I'd love to hear how your habits have changed since having a baby. So my habits basically changed because I eat later breakfast. I sometimes at least I don't wear makeup every day. Um, I drink more coffee, I get more tired, I don't do naps that often in the afternoon anymore because I want to get stuff done instead um, of napping because when she is awake she don't want to leave her side or she at least wants to sleep on her arms um, so we can't do stuff like that. We don't put ourselves first anymore. Is that a good habit to change? I think so. We still try to have our time like uh, I take baby girl and John has him time, like PlayStation time, um, and I have me time when she is sleeping, um, half of the time at least. The last one, how is Felix adjusting to the new baby? And as I said shortly in the beginning, he is doing so well. We are so proud of him because 
He doesn't show jealous behavior in any way. When we sit with her on the couch or in our chair, like in our arms, he lays on our legs or just uh, beside her. He always wants to be close to us and close to baby girl. He just relaxes. He's not as wild anymore. He is getting older obviously so he gets more calm but he doesn't have his nighttime flips where he gets lots of energy and run, ar uh, run around the house anymore. Not as he used to <laughs> at least. Yeah so the last thing that I want to mention about Felix is that right now he is sleeping because it is the afternoon where he so he usually sleeps um but sometimes when she talks or cries in the baby monitor what is it called a monitor i think he gets close to this and sniffs it and try to look for her and he can't find her because she is in the baby carrier and when i get out to get her i when she is finished uh, napping he always comes with me he always wants to get her with me so he uh, he looks out for her and Oftentimes he sleeps under the bed uh, or under her baby carrier or he keeps her safe. He looks out for her um, which is really really cute. He sometimes wants to lay in her bed. That's not something he is allowed to but he's not as naughty as he was before she came. There's been once or twice where he has just patted her head and this is she is she's real right <laughs> but yeah i'm going to go get baby girl so i hope you guys enjoyed this small q a and me rambling about baby girl if you have any questions or anything like that please leave them down below in the comment section and i will get back to you right now i don't have more to say about her otherwise she is she's perfect and we are so lucky and so 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 grateful that nothing is up with her she is just perfect and she's happy and she's smiling and she loves music and dancing and jumping on our lap um, she's beautiful we love her so much i hope you guys enjoyed and until the next video please take care and have a nice christmas i think it is christmas in a few days when i post this so merry christmas to you all and happy new year if i don't get post any more videos i don't know christmas time is always busy for us we are never home so i don't know if i have stuff to film maybe hopefully <laughs> i hope you guys enjoyed as i've said four times now so let's take care and bye <laughs>